Hello everybody, this is Solar Tiger with another video. Today's video will be a crypto mining video and today is the 3rd of May 2024 and this is another one of my crypto mining videos on a budget so a while back I did a video where I said I was uh, trying uh, Bitcoin mining but in a very small way because if you want to make any profit whilst mining Bitcoins you need to invest in high powered equipment that's expensive and uses a lot of electricity and last month in April the, it was the Bitcoin halving so before uh, the reward was uh, 6.28 Bitcoins if you found a block but last month that halved to three to just over three Bitcoins per block so that's that. So anyway, in my previous videos, I used a USB miners, USB Bitcoin miners. And I have one here. This is a Gecko Science New Pack USB miner, and this one can do about 90 giga hashes per second and you have to uh, use a powered USB hub to power it and if you're, if you're going to mine at 90 giga hashes per second you'll need a cooling fan uh, it's a cooling fan and it slots over the heatsink and you use a software called a CG Miner and that's how that works and this device actually mines Bitcoin there is an ASIC chip underneath this heatsink and that's how that works so I did that before for a while and it did work I mean you will not make a lot of money you make many a penny or two a day maybe so it's more of a hobby thing fun thing sort of get to know how mining works kind of thing but not a money making thing so and that's what I did before so you've seen videos on that then after that I got into mining a different currency I was mining Monero which you mine with a CPU in your computer and I'm doing that with these two chrome boxes here for mining Monero so that's how that's working so I was on YouTube watching videos and browsing the internet and I came across a video about this uh, crypto tab browser so you can either run on your computer or you can download an app for your phone and you can mine that way so if you download the desktop version it mines using your computer's CPU and if you download the mobile version it mines via a remote server so not mining using your actual phone so that's how that works. So I downloaded the version for Windows and I downloaded the uh, iOS version that I'm running on my iPhone. And I'll tell you that the iPhone version is not very good, it's very slow. I get about 60 or 70 hashes per second. And you won't go far with that at all. Uh, the Android version might be a bit better. Uh, mining via your phone 
and the remote server is still not going to get you a lot. So, I wanted to try this out without spending any money. So, to begin with, I downloaded it onto this. It is a Ace PC uh, T11. It's a budget mini computer, a very budget one. I did videos about this before. It has the Intel Atom processor, which is a very budget processor. And on the CryptoTab browser, with this, I got about 200 hashes per second. So not very good at all. So I decided that I would install it on something better. So I installed it on my Ryzen PC. I have now uh, installed Windows on this PC before it had Linux on it. So I downloaded and installed Windows 10 on this. And this has an AMD uh, Ryzen 5 5600G processor in it. It has 16 megabytes of L3 cache and it has 8 gigs of RAM. So it's a pretty capable machine and it has a 200 gig SSD in it. 200 and something, I can't remember exactly. And I downloaded a crypto tab browser on this and now we're getting uh, a hash rate of 7,400 of hashes per second, so about 7.4 kilo hashes per second, so that's a bit more healthy. And I've been doing this for about two weeks, and I've only just installed it on this in the last couple of days. So during the last two weeks, I had it on this budget mini computer and I ran it for a while on this mini computer this has an i5 processor in it and on my downstairs computer that has an i5 processor in as well so between all of them in the two weeks I've got up to this amount of Bitcoin that has an approximate value of uh, 38 cents so that's that uh, one of the reasons I decided to give this a go is because it has a lower lower payout threshold I think the minimum payout on this is 0 0.00001 bitcoins is the minimum payout now before I was mining with my USB miners, I had two of these, and I was mining on a Brains Pool, which was formerly called Slush Pool, but the minimum payout is a lot higher. So that was that. Uh, when you're mining with a CryptoTab browser, you're not actually mining Bitcoins. Because, as I said, you need more powerful machines to mine for Bitcoin. So what you're doing is you're mining uh, several different altcoins. And the crypto tab is giving you a payout in Bitcoin. So you're mining altcoins, whichever ones are the most profitable at the time and you're getting a payout in BTC. So that's how that's working. So I know that this machine is fairly good at mining uh, Monero, which is an old coin. So when I was mining Monero on this with XM rig, uh, this machine, uh, XM rig would give you a reading of about four kilo hashes and when I was mining on Monero Ocean uh, they use algo switching 
and same kind of thing it mines whichever currency is the most profitable with the random x algorithm and they pay you out in Monero now, I know this machine is good at mining Monero so that's that so anyway it it mines altcoins and pays you out in BTC which means you can mine on uh, cheaper equipment now this computer cost about 300 pounds so for me that was quite a bit of money uh, compared to uh, Bitcoin mining machines that's fairly cheap so I'm giving this a go uh, some people have had success with it and some people have not uh, some people say that it's hard to get a payout in other words you apply for a payout and some people have been waiting a long long time to get a payout so some people give it negative reviews because of that so I'm just giving it a go I have this equipment around and we'll give it a go I do have a, a Bitcoin wallet that I set up before so we will try and get a payout so when this digit becomes a one I can apply for a payout and I'll see if I get a payout so, and I will report back now I was mining with brains pool with my USB miners and the value I had on the website was worth about three UK pounds but I was nowhere near the minimum payout value so whatever I've earned is stuck in the website I can't withdraw it because I haven't got to the minimum so we'll give this a go and report back so this is Solar Tiger saying thank you for watching if you like my videos please click subscribe you're welcome to leave a sensible comment down below as I say my policy on comments is they only respond to sensible comments if you want to make a sarcastic comment I will simply ignore it that's just how I go so I also would like to get more subscribers to my channel at the moment I have about 400 subscribers I would like to get that up to a thousand subscribers because at the moment I don't have any monetization on my channel I don't have enough subscribers so I'd like to try to get to a minimum of a thousand subscribers so I can monetize my channel and any money that I make I can put into my projects whether that's solar power or electronics or uh, crypto mining or whatever at the time so if I can get up to, th up to a thousand subscribers and earn some money then I can probably make some more videos so this is Solar Tiger saying thank you for watching and until good until next time goodbye and thank you for watching thank you